Hello everyone, today we will learn the difference between DVR and NVR. We will see which system is best for you. DVR stands for Digital Video Recorder, and its function is to store the video feed coming from the cameras. DVR recorders process uncompressed videos with coaxial cables and compress the videos to digital signal before sending them out. The DVR system works with analog cameras. These eight numbers of port is used to connect the video signal from BNC, analog, cameras to the DVR. This DVR has a capacity to connect eight numbers of camera, while another DVR has 16 numbers of ports that means it has maximum capacity up to 16 numbers of camera. Based on your requirement you can purchase DVR. In the NVR system, video is captured with digital, or IP, internet protocol, cameras. IP cameras process video directly from the camera itself. The processed stream is then transferred to the recorder via an Ethernet cable. There are two types of NVR available. The first PoE NVR and second one is non-PoE NVR. PoE NVR recorder can deliver both data and power over a single Ethernet cable. There is no need for an additional PoE switch. You just need to connect one Ethernet cable from the camera to the PoE NVR recorder, and then the built-in switch will provide power to the camera while transmitting data. PoE NVR has limited ports. If you have more cameras compared to available ports in PoE NVR, then you should move with PoE switch. For non-PoE NVR you need to install separate PoE using a PoE switch also allows you to connect multiple cameras to one switch, and then only have to run one Ethernet cable back to the network that the NVR is connected to. For DVR, coaxial cable doesn't provide power to the camera. There are actually two cables included within one covering that is a power and video cable. These cables separate each end to give separate functions. Therefore, you'll need to install your DVR near a power outlet, while Ethernet cable provide data and power as well. Coaxial cable wiring required more cabling. Size and rigidity of coaxial cables make installation more of a challenge. Coaxial cables are wider in diameter compared to Ethernet cables used with NVR systems which can make it even more complicated to run cables in relatively tight spaces. The DVR analog systems use lower resolution cameras, although some brands have manufactured 4K camera systems. Since coaxial cable is used in DVR systems, therefore interference, rolling lines, and other issues are more likely to occur in the image. NVR systems not only deliver crisp, clear video footage, they can also capture audio without the need for standalone devices. The most significant advantage of IP cameras versus analog is that they can transmit digital data over long distances without losing quality. This is because the data is sent in digital form, which can be compressed and transmitted more efficiently. Both the DVR and NVR record video footage onto a hard drive. Most of the DVRs have no cloud storage functions, but some newer versions do. While they can record on the cloud, their functions and hardware are not as good as NVRs. They are simply not designed for that purpose. NVRs work better with cloud-based technologies, and are more specialized to store the footage on the cloud. This way you can reduce the burden of the local storage capacity and protect the recordings in case there's hard drive damage. Finally, both systems are reliable in recording video data. Although in the past the video quality of DVR systems lagged behind in comparison to NVR systems, today the gap is being closed. The difference between DVR and NVR systems comes down to cost, how data is transmitted, and the type of cameras. NVR systems tend to have much better picture quality, easier installation, increased flexibility, and native support for audio on cameras that have a microphone. Thank you very much to watching this video, please do like and subscribe Rashid Iqbal channel. We will see you in the next video.